So I have a theory. And I'm loving what you say, what you say, what you say when you're on my line. If I never make it back, make it back, make it back from the chase, I'm fine. Doesn't matter if it's left or it's right, your direction is on my mind. Uh, for starters, um, he's basically declaring his love for this person. And in the moment when they both floated, you cannot tell me that it is not referencing to late night talking when Harry's floating. Like he's letting it go. They are both letting it go. When Harry, even in daylight earlier, like oh, we just got daylight music video and then Harry's letting it all go and saying he's also letting it all go. He's accepting the love for this person, which if you guys go back to my theory, well, I think I do have a theory for uh, Tyrope. He does say that he is ready to let go in Tyrope. He says it. And then in the interview, when they ask him about Tyrope, he literally says. Zane, how are you feeling? What were you going through in writing Tightrope? So beautiful. Tightrope. Um, I was uh, starting to understand certain things um in my life and and starting to appreciate them um in in a different light um than than i was before um and i feel like that was kind of like uh the sentiment of the song um that i might have necessarily been uh running away from something and i kind of accepted that you know this is what it was and this is how i wanted it to be that he learned <laughs> that he literally accepted some things so that means <laughs> so that means that he finally accepted his love for his partner harry loves me a lot guys okay so i was literally um just gonna get information from the songs of harry uh from harry's house and i came up with a theory so in this new song of saying he basically says that he wants to love this person that he is feeling this much love for this person that he has felt before but this time is stronger and he doesn't want to let it go that he wants to embrace it he anytime he can and that he is so 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 in love and that it's something new that it's it's more than just the physical touch is more like more emotional he's basically saying that he is enjoying this new phase of this romantic thing so what i came up across is i was reading some uh other songs <laughs> lyrics from harry's house um, i had read them before but now i did it differently because i have heard the new song from saying and then i heard uh, i started reading the lyrics and it, Honestly, Harry's uh, new album, it's basically about a new relationship. It's talking how about a relationship was broken and it started building again. We saw that it's supposed to be backwards. So that means that the last, the first song, the, yeah, the last song is the first song. So that means Love of My Life is about the first song. And then it's Boyfriends and then Satellites and then Keep Driving uh daydreaming cinema uh matilda little freak daylight as it was grape juice uh late night talking and then music for sushi restaurant so when i was going at that um at that order uh the first one that came up to my mind was satellite i was like oh well he is talking about in satellite if you guys pay attention to the lyrics He's basically talking about how this person has a new life that they have to accomplish with uh, how they're trying to portray their relationship. And that is now a new thing since, you know, Saiyan's life changed it completely after his, uh, their album got a kid. Um, so his life is completely different now. He has to focus on his kid. And like he has said in his previous interview, he has her uh for half of the time so as i was saying in satellite he's saying that he got a new life and if he has time to him can they talk so that lyric is super deep <laughs> because he is feeling left out from saying his new life uh, but as the time as the album progresses with keep driving he's basically saying um they're escaping away from the reality at 
moments and he is enjoying it he's enjoying their uh moments when they escape from reality and it's just them too and i feel like he's talking about being in two scenarios when he wants to be with this person but he's fighting with this person a lot they're having a lot of problems and he just wants to be with this person like in daydreaming he says living in a daydream she said love me like you pay me you know i have gone for so long so give me all your love and give me something to think about to dream about sorry so he's basically saying that now it's harder to have this uh, person's love uh and i will like to speculate that is maybe harder because saying now has 50% of the time his daughter so he has to pay a lot of attention to his daughter so maybe he doesn't see Harry as often so this is how he, he portrays it right and in previously like I have said he does not like this change but it sounds like he's uh, getting used to it as those uh, as the songs progress in cinema he's basically talking about having sex with someone it is like that and if you guys did not sigh it pay attention to the lyrics reread them multiple times and you're gonna notice uh so this lyric it says it's you and i'm not getting over it darling is cool i'm sorry when it comes to this he's basically saying like i want to spend the rest of my time with you i will anytime i have i want to be with you and in Sane's new song he basically says that he doesn't want to waste time that he just wants to be with this person so see how this is connecting to the song he like this album is basically like literally the album is the answer for the song so like if you want to understand more the song of saying listen to harry's album literally uh and then in little freak uh we all speculated differently about little freak and i was paying attention now, now to little freak more after saying song so i said that they sound similar to love like this lyrics and i'm gonna read what i had said in that post uh well the lyrics first um i'm loving i'm loving what you say when you say when you're on my line if i never make it back make it back make it back from the chase i'll be fine doesn't matter if it's left or if it's right your direction is on my mind those lyrics i had said that it sounded like a little freak and a lot of you came after me being like just wait till the song and there you go there you go it is the same not the same but it sounds similar and i was right so <laughs> let's move on with the next song that i read and i got okay so daylight we just got a new video for daylight and tie rope is so heavy with this song like god <laughs> jesus anyways um go watch daylight the music video please i'll put the link in my bio so the lyrics for daylight it goes you got the antidote i'll take one to go please uh get the picture caught in the middle you ain't got time for me right now if i was a bluebird i'll fly to you you be the spoon and dip you in honey so i could be sticking to you so basically what he's saying again is that this person does not have time for him so they're still battling with how uh they're still battling and and trying to manage how to um get used to the new situation and you can see throughout the lyrics exactly what i'm telling you if you guys don't believe me you guys can go and listen to the album and then come back and comment please uh and then as it was this song is heavily talking about not being the same relationship so it says when everything gets in the way seems you cannot be replaced i'm the one who will stay in this world it's just us you know it's not the same as it was i feel like they they broke up i said multiple times that i feel like they broke up and that harry went through a lot a lot during that time because he's present in this album so hopefully in c4 we get to see his side of his point of view and his side of the story uh he did said that he wrote a lot of sad songs so uh let's wait and see <laughs> if he 
is talking about this relationship um and how it deals with the relationship and hopefully we get more answers but i feel like they did broke up and they got back together and he's and harry's talking about the relationship not being the same as it was just like saying the saying that this new relationship they is different in the song he's saying that this relationship is full of love and he feels it more deeper than before he's ready to let anything go for this person he was ready in tie bro but in this song he's more determined to prove that he loves this other person so basically i just told you guys <laughs> everything that was going in my mind and i'm gonna finalize with my favorite song that ties exactly with um Saiyan's new song which is late night talking and the lyrics read things haven't been quite the same there's the uh there's a haze on the horizon babe it's only been a couple of days and i miss you when nothing really goes to plan you stab your toe and break your camera i will do anything i can to help you through if you're feeling down i just want to make you a happy happier baby so basically he's saying again that they're doing all the late night talking they're spending this relationship is bright new it's in the talking stages when like you if you start dating you want to spend time with this person non-stop so i feel like if they went to the honeymoon again they restarted completely uh when they broke up uh i think both of them felt like it was final in saying three you can see that he's telling harry in outside i'm gonna i'm gonna wait for you but i'm gonna leave my love and see if you receive it if not like i'm gonna you know let you leave um so basically they did and, and my theory i think they did broke up and they got back together and they in this new re like because it is a new relationship they uh change completely it's it's a whole new relationship and i feel like both of them are liking this new relationship it's so different from previous relationship uh that they had so i feel like this new relationship is more of the connection that they have and the love that they have is fully fully completely about the love and you can even see it on saying music video it's heavy on love the way he is presenting the love for this uh person is supposed to be me like he recorded this music video to show us sort of the side of how his relationship with harry is now and i feel he's showing us that it's more lovey doubly than we expected um in previous videos we saw that the relationship was um mostly about sex uh, it was it was love there there was a lot of love but there was a lot more sex and i feel like in this new relationship they focus more on the love that they feel for each other than the physical love that they feel for each other i don't know if i'm making sense so yeah that's my theory um i wanted to record it with my face uh, but i just came out randomly in my head and i just started recording in my um app of voicemails or i don't know what's called memo something like that so i just started recording randomly and yeah so this is the best i can do uh, i hope you guys understand my theory i'm gonna wait for the album and when the album comes i'm gonna obviously do a full-on deep uh dive on everything and yes uh we still have to wait for the new album and see how that album leads us and hopefully we get more answers so um, this is all guys i hope you guys have a wonderful day